It's old, old school. Hey, hey, what? Come on, little Kim. Come on, come on, little Kim. Hey, hey. You're such a. But you can't move it that much though, because little Kim don't be moving shit. Yeah. Yeah. Are we lit? Are we lit? Are we lit? Just like making good. Yo, yeah. yeah. Trapping back, they all up in the hood. Yo, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. Nowadays, I don't smoke switch it, I smoke back wood. Yeah. yeah. flight to Mexico because they would not let me check a bag in because I did not arrive at the airport three hours three three before my flight so I had to rebook it now I'm not leaving until tonight versus 10 this morning but because I was rushing to make sure everything was fine to get there you know I'm there with like an hour and some change I left my computer on top of my car because I was parking at the garage so now on my way back I'm just talking to my sister this and that blah 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 and the parking attendant let me know she saw all the cops this and that blah, blah blah so i had to leave the airport come to the police station down the street to come pick up my computer left it on top of my car so we're going to proclaim right now that the vibe of this trip is going to be different because i can't do this man <laughs> okay so there's that <laughs> something publicly um, about me smoking and I'm beginning a few questions so I thought I would address it. So there is this really crazy misconception um, regarding smoking and being um, physically active. Um, my dad even used to be on my head about how it doesn't make sense that I smoke and then go work out. Um, and I have like an ebook blog thing coming soon really going into depth explaining my perspective of it. But you'd be surprised. There are a lot of fitness people who smoke because it helps put us in a different zone um, while working out and to push ourselves in a certain way. And yeah, um, a lot of the other questions were, do I do sativa and the curve? Um, I actually prefer hybrid because I like the balance in between the two. But if I have to pick, it'd be sativa. For sure, because it's an upper. <laughs> okay, so we made the security, and I am now walking to figure out where my actual terminal is, because my ticket, since it was bought this morning, um, doesn't have the gate information. So I made it through security and everything. Got my tripod with me. Um, and yeah, somewhere over here, I saw found it. Take me to Houston. Okay. Please make this easy. Uh, Houston, 1984. Let's see. That is. That is 1984. We are terminal 83 on time. Where is it? You took this way. Afternoon. Um, thanks so much, and uh, welcome back. <laughs> I literally have the entire beach to myself, and I'm sitting on my porch. <laughs> wow.
So before my phone dies, just on three percent, I literally am sitting outside in the rain. It's like sprinkling, but a thunderstorm's on its way, and it's like the most peaceful thing ever. There's also a yacht over there uh, that I guess is staying for the night because they've been there for like a good two hours. Random fact. It is pouring down. I keep seeing some very sweet in the water. Whoa! <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so I thought I was recording this whole time and I wasn't. <laughs> um but I found out that <laughs> a lot of ATMs on this part of town don't work. I used all my cash yesterday buying my fucking jewelry. This, I don't use flat tummy tea. I just use the bag. The bag is, just so I want to clear that up right now. The bag is the bag with all my shit in it. It's can be like my little, my little purse right now. Hold on. Um... So yeah, so I now have to walk 10 minutes to nearest ATM to get some cash out because the restaurant doesn't have an ATM, nor do they have Wi-Fi because it wasn't working yesterday for the card to work. Um, like I said, my hotel doesn't have Wi-Fi. The nearest one is a 10 minute walk. But the reason none of the ATMs are working is because the lightning that hit during the thunderstorm last night caused the power to go out and actually hit one of the I'm riding a bike <laughs> it says the morality of the nation can be judged by the way the animals are treated that's a fucking fact so cute when I came back into the hotel receptionist remembered it was my birthday I was like happy birthday and I was like oh my god thank you sis Enjoy my birthday breakfast. back to finishing the chapters of my new book regarding waking out and smoking weed. <laughs> oh yeah. I was bitten. I have been bitten by so many mosquitoes up to this point. Like, within my first 10 minutes, I probably got a legit maybe six <laughs> mosquito bites. I'm not kidding. They ate my ass literally up. Most of my mosquito bites are on my butt, and I'm confused because when I came in, I was wearing jeans. <laughs> like, so confused. Um, also, I didn't know that 
Mexico is going to sound really stupid, so don't judge me. I look really crazy, but I'm in a humble, uh, relaxed state, so don't judge me. I also didn't know that um, Mexico was considered the rainforest. Like, where we are in Tulum right now, technically, is the rainforest. I didn't know that. Um, so that's pretty awesome. And everything's been pretty good outside of the fucking bugs. No, we've had a few hiccups with the hotel, but we'll get into that later. Yo, these bugs are literally eating me alive. Um, I forgot to travel with bug spray. Um, and it's another thing that's really cool is they have dream catchers. I don't know if you can see it. Where is it? Where'd it go? I don't know if you can see it, but they have dream catchers everywhere. Like, literally everywhere. Oh, my head is literally so bad. So I look crazy. I'm so going to do an angle down here. I'm doing my layover in Houston. It's an open night layover. It didn't make sense to leave and go get a hotel because I would literally be sleeping in the hotel for like two hours. Maybe three before I come back to the airport. And I know me. I already fell into a deep sleep and I woke up. So I'm trying my hardest to stay awake in this airport because it's the middle of the night, but good gracious, I'm tired.